Did you guys have any mentors that you got um, into track and field, or anyone who was pushed to, pushed to keep you doing your events in school, outside of school? Um, I would say there's three people in particular. Um, obviously my mom and my dad as the top two. They, they never really expected anything to come of track and field. It was just go have fun, get off of our chest for a second. But now they're some of my biggest supporters. Um, and then definitely um, the coach I had um, my senior year, Coach Brunton, he still texts me like once a week asking how I'm doing. He's always checking up on me, making sure that I'm doing my workouts and everything. Um, he, they definitely just made the experience a lot more enjoyable. Um, like she said, our parents, uh, they, like, even if we were having a rough time, they wouldn't let us quit because we know that we would be miserable if we actually quit. Um, and then, like she said, Coach Brunton, and also my throwing coach from high school, uh, Coach Bum, he was, he's probably one of the best coaches I've ever had and he always knew how to like calm me down when I had a bad throw or I had a bad meet or a bad practice. And probably Tara, honestly, is another one because, you know, you always have to have a competition with somebody and it just happens to be my sister now. But looking back at all of your experiences for both of you at RMU, what, what's been your favorite moment so far? Um. Uh, I would have to say it was when I broke the long jump school record for indoor. Um, it's just the fact that all of my, all of my closest friends are on the track team. They, all of my closest friends and my parents and my sister got to see me do that. And it was just kind of like a heartfelt moment seeing that I've been working for this for so long that I finally like crushed my goal. And now I get to set um, a fresh pace going into outdoor. That was probably my favorite moment too. Um, even though I didn't compete how I wanted to at that meet, um, we were all just really proud of Tara. And like, if somebody had a bad meet, they put that aside and went and congratulated her and was so happy for her. And that's really when like we saw the team come together, like probably the most it has.